Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Saturday coming at you with 2020 Bowman Sterling Baseball. Brand new release, just dropped yesterday. Six box, half case, pick your team number three. So, fresh case right there. Big thanks to all of these lovely people here for getting into the action. We really appreciate it. And thanks for bidding, uh, spending a bit of your Saturday with us. The second half of the case is I think almost in single digits, so we should easily be able to do it tonight. Coop, what's going on? Oh yeah, how did it look? And what did, what was the what did the report say yesterday? I think I completely missed whatever earnings report was happening for DraftKings yesterday. Any any good takeaways? Full disclosure, ladies and gentlemen, I do have financial interest in DraftKings. <laughs> Not a huge stake, but. All right. So let's select a die and then roll a die and then we'll go one, two, three for the left side and four, five, six for the right side. And you can see on the top camera the die right there. I'm not going to turn it. I'm just going to push the die into this frame right here, into this camera. It's two. So we're going to do the left side right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. This we will save for next time. So this is pick your team three. So we'll see. We'll mark these. with fours right here. Right there. They gave a good outlook, DraftKings said. So, And the New Hampshire book looked good? I've heard good stories about the different, the other books in other places. You know, they're, they've been doing a lot of hiring, which is good. Stimulating the economy, giving people jobs, generating revenue for states. So yeah, definitely having no sports hurt them, but yeah, I think I think that stock is gonna it's gonna be great, in my opinion. They already have huge brand recognition already in the United States. Tons of advertising, you know. So it was packed. Good. It's a good sign. Hopefully, everyone was being safe, but packed. I don't think it's as crazy up in New Hampshire, right? COVID. David Downer, why can't they make sports betting legal everywhere? They're going to. Someday. It's happening. I think, what, a year ago, a year or two ago, they, the Supreme Court finally knocked down the. The federal ruling that banned single game wagering in the United States, aside from Las Vegas. So that was a huge step. And now it's up to each individual state to, uh, to make a decision on whether they want it or not. And I think most will. The only state that will probably never ever get it, Utah, I think. Eventually it'll happen because now, now it's a state's rights issue. Eventually most states will, will do it. Ooh, that's good. Zero debt on the books for DraftKings. I like that. $1.2 billion in cash. I think, I, I think a couple weeks ago, if I'm not mistaken, the stock dipped a little bit. But I think, I think some, in, some investors or some of the leadership had had actually withdrew money, but with the intention of putting it back into the company, something like that, you know, so anyway. It'll eventually happen, David Downer, don't worry. It'll eventually happen. There's Michael Baez to 50, and Brendan Shoemake for the Braves, Ryan Redman with the Bravos. Are we getting a flash flood here? Hmm. 
doesn't happen very often, but we're getting flash flood warnings in uh, Los Angeles County. There's Braden Shoemaker, Speckle for Ryan Redmond, and that is numbered down there. Kind of hard to see with the speckles right there, but that looks like 41 out of 99. There you go, 41 out of 99. All card ship as well. There's Michael Baez gold, 22 out of 50. That will be for the Padres. That's going to be for Anthony. There's Nolan Jones to 199. That's for the tribe. That's going to go to Rio, who has the Cleveland Indians. For the Red Sox, Jaron Duran Duran. Her name is Rio, and she dances on Duran Duran. Josh Pruce with the Bo Sox. And Andrew Vaughn for the White Sox. I don't know if Andrew Vaughn has been called up. Is Nick Madrigal playing, though? It's one of those guys. But anyway, Josh Pruce also has the White Sox. He's got socks that are red and white. Got Anthony K, Speckle, and Bryson Stott for the Phillies. That will be for Brandon. Anthony K for the Buffalo Blue Jays, Brandon as well with that one. Where's that number? Looks like bottom left-hand corner. 48 out of 99. And a plate? Is that a plate auto? No, just a plate for the Blue Jays and a die-cut autograph. The plate is Bo Bichette. Nice. That's also for Brandon and the Buffalo Blue Jays. Buffalo! That's a good slot machine. Buffalo Gold. Brandon, all aboard the Big Head Express. Whoop, whoop. And the die cut autograph is gonna be Anthony Volt. Die cut auto 77 out of 99 for the Bronx Bombers. Nice. That is a, that's also for Brandon. There you go, Brandon. Seth Brown and Adrian Morahone. That one. All right. Box two. boxes, another five autographs. Love this stuff. A lot of autographs. Cardinals scoring another run. They're up 6-3 right now on the White Sox. I guess they're well rested, the Cardinals. What are the car what are they what do we do? The car are the I don't even know how baseball is gonna take handle this situation here. Cardinals have only played like what is only like their sixth or seventh game? A zillion seven inning double headers might be the only way they could they could get enough games in to I guess make it worthwhile. Otherwise, do they forf do they forfeit games? How does this work with the playoffs? Do they go by winning percentage? Don't know. Something that baseball has to figure out. All right, 
Next box. We've got orange Sam Huff. 10 out of 75. Rangers. Mark Bissett with Texas. Beautiful new stadium in Dallas, but no one can go there. Not yet, anyway. It's supposed to be nice and air conditioned, domed up. I know. Michael Toglia. COVID got in the way. Colorado Jarrell Taylor with the Rocks. It's the Michael Toglia. Grant Gambrill, 84 out of 150, refractor autograph. For Kansas City, Blake. Dylan Carlson to 99. FSL, what's going on? Again, don't know. I guess he'll just play a bunch of double headers. Another Braden Shoemake. Braves autograph. Second one for Ryan Redmond. Braves are playing right now. I think they just started. Bottom of the second inning, zeros. And there's Brady McConnell. Are the Royals playing right now? No, the Royals are... Yeah, well, they are playing. They're up 4-2 on the Twins in the bottom of the fifth in Minnesota. That'll go to Blake and the Royals. And Ryan Gamsby with uh, with my Dodgers. Oh, that's right, Andrew Miller on the uh, on the Cardinals. I kind of forgot about that. Andrew Miller is already 35. Eloy Jimenez up to bat. Dust off your Eloy Jimenez. Jimenez is one for two with a dinger. Brewers are up 6-4 on the Cubs in the friendly confines. Oh, it's the bottom of the 10th. Looks like, went to, looks like they took the lead in extras. Phillies up early, 1-0 on the Mets in Philadelphia. And Luis Robert bangs one, bangs a grounder through uh, the middle of the infield. Ball with eyes. Yeah, Ricky, let's do it. I haven't done one of those mixers yet. Are you talking about mix or is, do we get to put a fresh case, case of jumbo up? Other scores are happening here. 0-0 zero, zero in, in Miami. Braves, Marlins, 0-0. Zero, zero. Indians at Tigers, 0-0. Zero, zero. Rays at Buffalo, just started, 0-0. Zero, zero. And we got the Cardinals-White Sox game on in the background. Cardinals up 6-3 in the south side. Ooh, fresh case of jumbo up. Nice. I do love that Topps Chrome. Let's do it. We got Matt Manning revealing a Joe Ryan and a Robert Pawson right there. Look at that. That's the first one I've seen. Tampa Bay, Robert G with the Joe Ryan. And let's just skip over to this guy right here. His name is Robert Pawson. Big international prospect. A lot of hype around him. David Larson and the Oakland Athletics. Nice. His name is Robert Pawson. His name is Robert Pawson. Matt Manning for the Tigers. Matt Stubblefield. Jason Dominguez is nice. 
Bryson Stott, Speckle Auto for the Fightin' Phils. Brandon. And the number is hiding right down there. 77 out of 99 on that one. Jason Dominguez. Brandon Tharp of the Yankees. It's the base Dominguez. Nick Lodolo, 62 out of 75, reveals a Ruben Cardenas for Robert and the Rays. And Jake Sanford for the Yankees. Another one for Brandon. There's Nico right here as well. Cubs mark the set. Go, Luis Robert up again. One for two. Solo home run in the third. Now he's got Eloy on first. Nick Lodolo for the Reds. Pink. Darren McKenzie. Halfway through this half case break. Second half in the store. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. one up to deep center. No one's tagging, no, nothing. Just feel like just got under it. Could have another another home run. in the back foot. Eloy scampers the second. What's the call here? No, in the dirt. I think it went between his legs. Slider that just kept sliding inside, 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 through his legs. All right, another box. Good luck. I think Alex Young is making a start tonight. Dust off your Alex Youngs. Kanan Smith. Yankees, that's going to be another one for Brandon. Yep, Ale young Alex Young making a start tonight. We're going to sleeve this up right now, Arthur, because he might have a no-hitter. Right? Against the Padres. And then Arthur will be like, boy, I'm glad Joe sleeved this up because now it's worth a million dollars because of the no-no. And the Wave Refractor autograph, Josh Young, 57 out of two, uh, 125. Big prospect for the Rangers. That's going to be for Mark Vissett. And Michael Bush, Dodgers prospect. 
93 out of 99. Speckle autograph. Dodgers. Once again, that's Ryan Gans, who's got my my team. What? Oh, oh, right. They're doing a double header. That was the last frame. So seven inning double header. There you go. All right. I guess the Cardinals are just gonna do a zillion seven inning double double headers. So gear up, Nolan Gorman. There he is. Eleven out of ninety nine. That goes to Matt Morgan and the Cardinals. Paul, what's going on? Uh, no, I've not seen any Luis Robert yet. I think you got an Andrew Vaughn autograph, Josh, and a uh, Jaron Duran autograph. So you're, you hit. There's Dre Jameson, Diamondbacks for Arthur Peru. And there's Grant Gambrel. Well, we still got 10 autographs left, so there's still still a chance. Or a low numbered parallel, that'd be great too. Royals, Blake. All right, two boxes to go. Thanks everybody. Second half in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com. 30 autographs total in this break. Pretty awesome. I don't know when we're gonna get more. I think we're out as of now. So get into it while supplies last. Robert Grease looking for some Jordan Alvarez. As I love original programming. Oh, is there just no no baseball games on right? Are there some games live? No. no. MLB Network doesn't want to put on Rays Blue Jays. Show me a game in Buffalo. They don't want to show us Indians Tigers. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade for a little bit. Oh, this is the end. You have chosen poorly. Well, on the Paramount Network, apparently. Okay. I didn't realize we had this here. We got a pretty good direct TV package here. We named the dog Indiana. Had a lot of fond memories of that dog. There's uh, Kim Kwan Hyun, 42 out of 50, revealing a Daniel Espino. Refractor wave autograph, 18 out of 125. Rhea with the tribe. That goes to Matt Morgan. We got Kevin Biggio. Sterling first signs. Four out of 99. And a blue die cut autograph. Who's that gonna be? It's gonna be Shea Langliers. Die cut autograph for the Bravos. Eight out of 25. Nice. Ryan Redman and the Braves. Does he? I didn't. I actually did not realize that. 
David Downer pointing out that Bo Bichette already has five home runs this year. We got Nick Solak, rookie speckle for the Rangers. There it is, 34 out of 98. That'll be for Mark Bissett. It looks like another Daniel Espino autograph for uh, Rhea and the Indians. And J.J. Goss. I pulled a J.J. Goss Super Fractor last night. That was pretty fun. Rays, Robert. Are there out of fives? We can still look for out of fives. We can look for lower, lower numbers, too. Supers are fun, though. And we've got... Wow. Did you call it, Josh Proust? That's sorcery. Someone, someone check to see if he's a witch. Burn that sorcerer at the stake. Set him on fire. See if he burns. He probably won't. He won't. Throw him into a lake. 93 out of 150. Refractor rookie autograph Luis Robert has a home run today. Back at what what time are we at? We're at what time is it right now? 3.54 p.m. on the West Coast. At 3.51 p.m. on my timestamp in the chat, Josh Pru says this is the box for Luis Robert. I can feel it. Sorcery. Sorcery. That's... I don't know what kind of wizardry that is. We got, got Professor Dumbledore, Dumbledore up in here. We got Gandalf here, ladies and gentlemen. In our in our midst, in our presence. Very nice hit. Good call. What a call. All right, last box. Good luck, everybody. Still a lot of autographs to go. So don't give up just yet. Play to the whistle. That's what we always say around here. Play to the whistle. Got to. Now David Downer's got me thinking. What are what are some other what what are some other 2020 regular season stats that we have to look at here? So Aaron Judge is leading the league with nine home runs, right? Guess who's second in the league with eight home runs? Tied? No, there's four players tied with eight home runs. Some of you, some of these players, you will know. Mike Trout has eight home runs, right? He's pretty good. Fernando Tatis Jr. has eight home runs. That's not surprising, right? JT Real Muto has eight home runs already. Nick Castellanos has eight home runs, tied for second in all of baseball. What's up, Lindsey? I, I wouldn't have predicted that. Not even, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't even be close. I would, I would say Castellanos would have like three home runs by this point. Two, two or three. And what, 20 games into the season? 15, 20 games into the season? Real Muto has played five fewer games and has eight home runs, by the way, than Castellanos. Betts has seven home runs thanks to that three home run performance the other night. Teoscar Hernandez for the Blue Jays has seven home runs. Matt Olson has seven. Nolan Arenado has six. Chapman, Matt Chapman, Nelson Cruz, Eloy Jimenez, Brandon Lau all have six. Mitch Moreland has six. Rosario has six. Yes. There you go. Yeah, those those are those are your those are your home run home run leaders. All right. Last box. Good luck. There's Riley Green, Tigers. Matthew Subfield. 
Yeah, I think I think when's his contract? JT Real Muto's contract up. You know, Phillies are gonna be like, man, we've got we gotta pay this guy now, maybe. Got Last Crusade on in the background before we find some more baseball games. And Bobby, what a case. We got Luis Robert and a Refractor Wave Autograph, 69, nice, out of 125, Bobby Witt Jr., Blake. Wow, JT Riomuto's a free agent after this year. I feel like a lot of teams could use a JT Riomuto. There's Grayson Rodriguez, pink, 45 out of 75 for Mark L. and the O's. We got another Michael Bush Dodgers autograph. It's another one for Ryan. There, there's Blake. He was wit hunting. You got it. Congrats. There's JJ Bladé to 199. Miami, Matthew. And we've got a Brett Beatty. I think we got a gold autograph down there, or gold something down there. Gold parallel, gold auto maybe. Brett Beatty. For the Metropolitans, Brandon. Oh, it's a gold auto. There's a Jordan rookie card. And it's a Jordan Yamamoto. 41 out of 50 rookie autograph for... Matthew Stubblefield and the Miami Marlins. And, and a Luis Robert rookie card at the very end for Josh Proust and the White Sox. Excellent break for you, man. And there you go, boys and girls. Got the Bobby, which a bunch of other nice cards in there too. Luis, this is worth maybe taking a quick look here. So pretty nice stuff. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. Second half of this uh, case. This seems like a pretty strong case. So second half is in the store. You know, just the way things go sometimes in group breaking on jazbeescasebreaks.com. If you didn't hit in the first half, hopefully you got him in the second half. The plate, by the way, where'd the plate go? There it is. Plate, by the way, Boba Shed, of course. Very nice. And there you go. Thanks, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.